To be honest, I never heard of Rosemary Bly's case before Summer Wells went missing. I believe that could be the case with many. If you did, then let me know. Would love to know if you heard of her case before Summer vanished. Rosemary Bly was last seen leaving her home in St. Croix Falls, Wisconsin. She was just going around five miles to Cushing, Wisconsin, to meet up with a relative for drinks. Rose had two very young children at the time, and they were at home with her husband at the time. According to some articles I read he was given a polygraph and is not a suspect in her disappearance. Rose's car was found five days later in Grantsburg, Wisconsin, in a parking lot typically used by truck drivers to park their tractor trailers. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but Rose's mother, Candace Hare lived in Grantsburg, Wisconsin at the time too. Anyway, Chris McDonough says he spoke to the lead detective in Rose's case a few days ago. He said that the detectives are frustrated that YouTube is throwing false accusations out there and they are focusing on somebody but obviously won't reveal who it is. Chris McDonough is hoping to get an interview with the sheriff. I believe this is great news for Rosemarie Bly's case. It is moving forward and they are actively working on it behind the scenes. Just wanted to share this quick update with all of you. I hope the same is going on behind the scenes for Summer Wells and that it doesn't take more than 10 years to get answers for her. We are already reaching the one year mark. I cannot believe it. One year and still no answers for Summer Wells. My heart breaks for her.